think there's a lot more awareness now, and I definitely think that your generation is more accepting um, than maybe even the kids who were here 20 years ago of each other, um, which is fabulous. And I like to think that some of the staff have um, made that happen by being very brave themselves. So I will say that you know, going away for 12, 12 years and coming back, it seems to be a lot more comfortable. I think that, so when I was in GSA, it was a really big group of people and I led the club and it was, what I thought was important about it is that there was like a physical space for people to be in and feel safe and just hang out with each other. I think Feminist Club also, like it made a lot of people uncomfortable because they were like, Feminist Club, what is, what is that? What is this thing? What is this Facebook group that people are posting in? I, I think that it, it challenged a lot of people and so it like started a lot of conversations that needed to be started. I don't know if it like directly contributed to safety, but at least like it made people, people were like talking about really important issues and other people were like uncomfortable about it in a good way. Um, but even 1994, which is probably before you were born, um, it still wasn't, I can understand how if some staff especially felt a little bit uncomfortable. Um, and so, you know, going forward to when I got here last year, um, it seemed like that had definitely changed. So I think that the physical space was really important and then also we did a lot of like educational presentations and activities together and so people were learning from each other. I've attended quite a few lunch sessions in the couple of years that I've been here that the GSA has had um, where they've had a presenter or, or a guest speaker come and those classrooms, when I've seen that, those classes have been packed. Um, I just attended last week a um, presenter that was actually so big for the classroom, it had to be in the choir room. Uh, that's fabulous. I mean, that really shows progress. Um, so I think that that's been a great way for people who are unsure or unclear or just have questions. Like, I don't even know if I'm comfortable with this but come with me with lunch and let's go, we'll sit in the back. And then to hear the presentation and hear what people say, it's like, oh, okay. And then maybe next time they'll sit in the front and maybe next time they'll ask a question. So I think that the feminist club calling me in and calling me to task about the dress code, that that's fabulous. And I think that that's, that's the way to make change. So I think that those two groups have really done have really begun the work of changing mindsets around here. And I think what's great about um, students is your mindsets aren't all set yet. Kids just want to know the truth and they just want things to work out well for everybody. And um, I've been so impressed not only by these presentations, but by the attendance at them.